Hello everyone, welcome to Programming Credit. Today in this video, we'll discuss about the difference between business analysts, data analysts, and data scientists. So things which I will cover in this video are what will be your responsibilities, what will be the scope of all these three roles, and also salary ranges for all these three roles. So that's exactly what we'll be discussing in this video. So do stick till the end of this video to get the full information. And uh, yeah, as always, if you are new here or not subscribe to the channel, please go subscribe to the channel and be a part of programming Kegel family. And also hit that bell icon so that you get notified each time our video goes live. And if you end up liking this video, please give it a thumbs up. It keeps me motivated to make a video for you guys. And I also do live stream on Saturday 12 p.m. British summer time. So do join us there as well. And if you want to schedule a one-to-one -one meeting with me, you can join the channel membership and you can do that as well. So with that being said, let's start the video. So let's first talk about business analysts. Business analyst's main role is to make a bridge between stakeholders and your technical team. Technical team could be your data analyst or data scientist team. So you will take a problem statement from your stakeholders, convert it into a technical problem, give it to your data analyst or data scientist team. So that is what a business analyst usually does. So you should be really good with your communication skills and also with presentation skills because after you have the results, you will convert into convert it into a proper presentation and present it to your stakeholders so that is what you need to be a business analyst so if you need a dedicated video of each and every skills that you need to be a business analyst or data analyst do let me know in the comment section i'll be more than happy to make a video on that if you need a video for uh, data scientists i already have a video on the channel so i will either leave a card or i will leave the link in the description so you can check out that video after this video so now if we talk about the scope of uh, business analyst is most of the smaller companies don't really need a business analyst because they can do everything by just one team because they don't have too much communication gap or they don't really have too much hierarchy so they don't really need a business analyst but in bigger companies they do need a business analyst the scope of business analyst is mainly restricted to bigger companies having said that it's not like smaller companies don't hire business analysts if they really need it, they will hire, but usually bigger companies tend to look for business analysts rather than a smaller company. So now if we talk about the salary range, so a salary can start from 27,000 pound and it can go all the way up to 75,000 pounds and it averages around 45,000 pounds for business analysts. So that is the salary range for business analysts. After that, let's now move on to data analysts. So the main role of data analyst is to analyze the data, get insights from it and help the business to grow. They don't really focus too much on forecasting, like uh, trying to make a predictive model to predict what will be the sales in next year or things like that. So their main goal is to just analyze the data and improve the business. If we talk about the scope of uh, data analyst is even smaller companies would need it and bigger companies definitely need data analysts. So in a smaller company, if they have a data, but if they don't have too much of data to train a predictive model, so they probably won't go for data scientists. They can stick with the data analyst where data analyst would analyze the data and extract the information from it because data is a very different thing from information and for stakeholders, information is more important than the data. So that is what will be the role of uh, data analyst. Again, if you need the video for the skills needed for a data analyst do let me know in the comment section i'll be more than happy to do that so now we will talk about the salary range for data analyst is it ranges from around 24000 pound and it can go all the way up to 60000 pounds and it averages somewhere around 37000 pounds so that is the salary range for data analyst and like I told you, the scope of data analyst is throughout the market. So even smaller business need it, even uh, bigger business would need data analyst. Now, with that being said, let's move on to our next role, which is data scientist. So data scientist is actually an umbrella term and it covers data engineer, data analyst, uh, and also machine learning engineer, and also deployment part. So it can be related to ML ops. So there are a lot of different skills that you need to be a data scientist and also you need to have good communication skills because you will be interacting quite a lot with your stakeholders and also other team members. If it's a small company, then definitely you will be carrying out everything. But if it's a big company, you will have to 
collaborate with other team members and you will have to probably take data from a uh, business analyst or at least data engineer and then maybe analyze it and then train your model and then give it to your software engineer team who will deploy it uh, or the team which will be dealing with ml ops so things like that or if it's a small company then you will be carrying out all these things so that is essentially what data scientists would do and if we talk about the scope almost all type of companies need a data scientist because a data scientist can do a lot of different things so that's why they are more value to their company at least having said that it's not like other job roles don't add value to the company i mean if it for if that was the case then probably companies wouldn't hire data analyst or business analyst but that is not the case but the thing is it totally depends on company to company what they actually are looking for and they probably have the most scope or most opportunity now if we talk about the salary range so salary for a data scientist can start from 30000 pound and it can go all the way up to 75 to 80000 pounds and it averages around 50000 pounds so that is what the salary range is for a data scientist so that is what I wanted to discuss in this video. I hope this video gave a little bit of clarity to you. If it did, <laughs> give it a like. And uh, so yeah, that's what I want to discuss in this video. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, do subscribe to the channel for more such videos. And if you are into data science, link of the notes will be in the description. You can download that. You can also join our Telegram group where we have a lot of different people discussing about a lot of different stuff. So it will be a very use, very useful stuff for you. So yeah, with that being said, hope to see you in the next video. Bye. Happy learning.